Hi, I'm Paul Larkin, along with my brother Harvey. We operate Larkin Brothers in New Glasgow on 68 Larkin Lane is where the farm is. Our processing plant uh, that we purchased a couple of years ago is out in Crapo. Over the last 20 years, uh, we've been growing turkeys and chickens without any medication in the feed. All our barns are designed with big doors, so there's vent fresh ventilation. 25 years ago, Dad had a few turkeys for his family. So we used to grow 25 and then it went to 50, then it went to 300 and then now we're presently growing uh, between 10 and 12,000 turkeys. We start off in January with turkeys for Easter. We get some extra ones so that we can uh, have turkeys for the freezer for our frozen market for the food service and the wholesale industry. We get turkeys in May, June, July, August and September so there's only a few months of the year that we don't get any. The turkeys uh, for three months will get you around a 13 to 15 pound uh, turkey and then we grow them up to six months and that gives us various weights from 18 to 22 to 25 pounds. The toms are the male turkeys and we grow them for five to six months and we take them and debone them for uh, our value-added product. We take all the dark meat, which is put into our sausages and meatballs, and the breast we use to uh, smoke for sandwiches. We have a little market for that, and uh, another market for boned-in breasts uh, that made Marion uses in Charlottetown. Uh, Papa Joe's in Charlottetown also uses our bone-in breasts, so those are a couple. And these are the propane brooders that heat our burns, burn a lot of propane big tanks outside for every burn. The birds, when they come in as day olds, uh, temperature needs to be 92 degrees. Uh, any cooler than that, they crowd in the corner, so they, they need to be comfortable. So, And as they get older, then we slowly uh, turn the temperature down and turn the fans on for fresh air. Our feeding system is well, timed, it comes on once a day and uh, the water in front of them all the time and feed in front of them. Uh, they can't run out of feed because if they do, then they all go to the feeders at once and climb over the top of each other. So it's really important that uh, there's feed in front of them all the time and water in front of them all the time. The feed that we use to feed our chickens and turkeys, are they're all fed with feed that is medication free and no animal byproducts in the feed. Feed's a little more expensive. They take a little longer to grow but at the end of the day, it's a better tasting product. It's a product that uh, people my age and uh, people a little bit older grew up on. One of the things that we enjoy as a company at Larkin Brothers is to hear the feedback from people that enjoy and our product. We have a retail location in Crapo at the store we have a, where we have our processing plants so we, anybody can stop in there. There is a few spots around Charlottetown that carry our product as well. And uh, you can go to our website at larkinbrothers.com and it gives you a list of all our products. And would also encourage all Islanders to, we are not the only people that grow chickens and turkeys. Support your neighbor, buy local. All our product that we produce at Larkin Brothers stays on PEI, it doesn't go off the island. So all the birds that we grow and process are on PEI, they stay on PEI, and again, encourage all islanders to support local.